Danny goes to the HR person and says, I was walking down the hall and Kelly grabbed my butt, right? And I feel like I've been sexually harassed. Well, have you? You might be violated. You might have been battered. Legally, have you been sexually harassed? That is what you all have to think about. Now, is the grabbing of the butt once because it's not sexual harassment, does that make it okay? No. In that situation, Danny could sue Kelly for battery. If Kelly is a serial copper feeler, right? And you know, because the HR person has had every Tom, Dick, and Harry come and say, Kelly walks around and cops a feel. Then there's other claims that you could have. Negligent retention, right? If, if Kelly has in her background these battery charges because she likes to cop a feel everywhere she goes and you haven't done proper background checks, negligent hiring possibly. Then if you are the manager, you are not training everybody, negligent supervision, right? So it's not just about Title VII, it's not just about the Florida Civil Rights Act, it's not just about whistleblower. Think about the other things. And don't think because Kelly copped the feel that your name won't be in the lawsuit. Because if I do that while I'm at work, they're going to allege that I was doing it in furtherance of your business. Now, I don't know how grabbing your butt and copping a feel is in furtherance of your business, but it will be a claim and it will cost you.